What's up productive people? It's Connor from BusyBox and in this video we're gonna go over how to do a factory reset. A factory reset is used when you want to default back to the BusyBox original settings. Please note all previous presets will be deleted when you perform a factory reset. It's the best option should you decide to sell your BusyBox as well. Little pro tip, similar to performing a computer reboot, you will need to access the reset button on the back of the BusyBox. To do so, remove the BusyBox from its wall mount or table stand. All right, once you have your BusyBox off of your table stand or wall mount, turn it over so the arrow is facing you and pointing up. The reset button is located on the right side of the BusyBox if you're looking at its back side or on the opposite side of the USB-C charging port. All right, make sure your BusyBox is turned on. To perform a factory reset, hold down the left button and press and release the reset button. Watch this quick demonstration. Please note the buttons should not be pressed at the same time. First, hold down the left side button. Once the BusyBox is turned off, press and release the reset button. Do not take your finger off of the left side button during the entire process until your BusyBox lights back up. This usually takes a bit longer than 10 seconds. After your BusyBox turns back on, it will be ready to pair with your phone. To do so, you can either delete the device from the device page, or you can click on the grayed out BusyBox and follow the pairing instructions. Please check out the entire series of YouTube videos we've created to help you troubleshoot any problems you may run into, to show you all of the features of our products and apps, and we even offer pro tips for those looking to deep dive. To access all of our videos, click the link in the description below or navigate to our channel. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe if you want to be alerted when we post new content, explain new features, and launch new products.